Our next guest hosts a very cool show, much like ours, only for the home improvement industry. We learn a lot from him and his weekly newsletter, amongst other things. Tom Kreitler is the host of The Money Pit. How are you, sir? Excellent, Dave. How are you? Doing fine. I was thrilled to hear that you are actually also doing your show from CBS. Yeah, that's right. Actually, we recorded it today um, over from the uh, convention center and had a whole host of guests, much like you folks do, uh, talking about some of the technology and as it applies to the home. It was very exciting. And it's really neat because, I mean, this, as you may have heard, is our 14th year broadcasting from here. Thank you. And, and the fact that we last this long sometimes just <laughs> makes me wonder uh, in general, but especially at a show like this, yeah. it's, it, it is our show, much like, I guess, home shows are your show. Yeah, that's show, right. Especially. The hardware show and the mm -hmm. builder show are, are sort of the big shows that we come to. We actually have never been here before, but thought, you know, people are staying home and they're working on their houses and they're, they're uh, experiencing lots of wonderful new electronics. So many of those are applying to the home improvement space. Why not come here and uh, see what we could learn? Very cool. So um, I imagine then your first time at CES, uh, at first it's an eye-opening experience it is to see the size of this show right you were at the main convention center we're here at the sands expo mm -hmm. all part of the consumer electronics show and it had to blow you away because even well, even the builder shows as big as they are i don't yes. think they're quite this big no no <laughs> we we actually max out at about 70 80 thousand people ah, so they're pretty thirty thousand right here. it's yeah. a, 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 a <laughs> mere drop in the bucket compared, <laughs> right. compared to this show though but it's very impressive very well run uh, and uh, a lot of excitement, a lot of optimism here. You know, there's no recession in this room. That's a good point. And, yeah. and, and while there is in a lot of other industries, the consumer yeah. electronics business say folks still want their entertainment. Yes. They still need their home improvements. They still yep. need home security and automation. Maybe they cut back a little bit, but they're still doing it. They're still buying. And also, don't forget, they're staying home. This whole staycation yeah. theme. Yes. We've been talking about it, you know, for quite a while now over the last couple of years. But as people do stay home, they're doing more work on their home. They're improving their space. They can't afford to move. That's true. But they still want to enjoy themselves. They still want to take advantage of the technology. And so they're doing that more and more. And you're going to see that kind of uh, trend be focused now more with the economy as it is. So some of the uh, uh, interviews, I guess, that you were doing here, too, talking to some exhibitors and so forth, anything yeah. jump out at you, uh, especially at your first CES, that, that you kind of were wowed about? Well, there's just so many things. I mean, we talked with the folks from UMA. Perhaps you've talked with them as we well. The, the voice over IP uh, devices it basically cuts your phone bill down to zip, you know, neon, n yep. nothing, zero. Uh, that was pretty cool. Um, you know, I uh, just spent a little bit of time with the folks over at the Roomba booth. The iRobot people. Sure. They got a little robot called the Luge now. Yes. That goes through the gutter. <laughs> cleans your gutters. Cleans your gutters robotically. <laughs> I mean, it doesn't get much better than that. True. Not you something know? that we need a lot in Miami where we're from, but no? most of the rest of the country yes. needs to clean their gutters. Right. And, you know, I do a little segment <laughs> on my show about all of the evils that befall you if you don't clean your gutters. You know, you usually think of uh, just the water falling on your head when we're talking about slippery sidewalks and cracked foundations and all Jeez. kinds of things when that water collects around your house. So that stops wet basements and a whole bunch more. Yeah. Who would figure? leaves could cause so much problem. It does. Right? It causes a lot of pain. <laughs> yes, very true. Yeah. And of course, you talk about home automation, and obviously that's we something do. that you cover too. Very interesting how you can do so many things. It used to just be, okay, maybe automatically dim the lights or right. turn on a light or something like that. So much more now these days. And also, it's become much more simpler. You know, it used to be very, very complex to install automation systems, but every time I look at a new one, they get easier, they get easier. They use the power line. They use wireless technology. It just becomes a lot easier and a lot faster. Oh, for sure. Tom Kreitler, the host of The Money Pit. Of course, moneypit.com, even themoneypit.com will get you to the That's site. Right. So do check it out and, of course, listen to his show also on great radio stations across the U.S., many that carry both of our programs. So uh, we appreciate that. Tom, thanks for joining us here at CES. I'm glad you're here and I'm glad that you're experiencing this for the first time. Hopefully we'll get you back next year. Very exciting. Thanks, Dave. My pleasure. More from Into Tomorrow, by the way, next week, four solid weeks worth of CES coverage, three hours a week. You can't miss a minute of it. Swing by our site at graveline.com or into tomorrow.com, if you will. Check out the video podcast from all of our guests. Check out their links. Check out all of our behind the scenes video highlights. A new one every week. It's all there for you at the site. So join us on the web, won't you? Thanks for tuning into tomorrow.